Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. My name is Muji Salah and you're welcome to my channel Muji in Touch. So I started um, a series a couple of episodes back called the in and out of beauty. If you haven't watched the series one and series two, just click to watch. I talked about um, what I used to care for my face in the series one and in the series two I talked about the things that I used to take care of my body. But today I will be talking about the things that I used to care for my mouth, my teeth, also my hands and my feet finally. Firstly let me show you the things that I used to care for my mouth. So I brush my teeth with my toothbrush which is very firm and steady, the bristles are intact and my toothpaste, the Colgate mouth toothpaste. This one has the Max White Micro Crystals. I love to use the <laughs> toothpaste with um, whitening effect on them. So I think they are nice, they do the job, especially this one, Colgate. So my toothbrush and my toothpaste, I like to brush my teeth twice daily in the morning and in the night time. So when I'm finished brushing my teeth, I like to go ahead and gargle with my Listerine mouthwash. This is Listerine Zero mouthwash. I love the flavor of this one. It keeps my mouth, it gives me that freshness in my mouth all day. Well, we don't want smelly mouth, do we? No, no mouth odor. So it prevents the mouth from cavity, from gum diseases, and it prevents um, the mouth from the causative agent of um, mouth odor and all those germs and diseases in the mouth. For all those science-oriented people, it's called the Entamoeba gingivitis. So look it up, I'll put it somewhere on the screen. And I recently started using these interdental brushes, uh, which was um, recommended to me by my dentist. It has a little bristle on there. So it looks like this. I chose the pink one, I love pink. <laughs> so when I think there's um, food residue hiding um, anywhere around my teeth, I just stick it in instead of using too big. So those are the things that I use to care for my mouth. And onto my hands. I like to um, pamper my hands. <laughs> I use this satin hands from Mary Kay. They have a new packaging for them now. So I will leave all the links down below for Mary Kay um, websites or where you can purchase them. This is um, the um, satin and hand scrub. I like to scrub my hands with this one and I use the hand cream as much as I need. Then I use the night emollient cream um, if I need extra moisture on my hands. So those are the three that I use to pamper my hands. But I keep my fingernails short, I, as you can see, once in a while, when I have the time, I wear nail polishes, but I don't like my nail polish, polish uh, chipped. So I keep it short, I keep it clean, especially clean. <laughs> so for my feet, these are the things that I use to care for my feet, everything in there. So I bought this um, foot um, spa, I bought it from one of the local drugstore, a pharmacy. So I use this one to do my pedicure at home. If you don't do your pedicure, try it, it's fun. So you know you're taking care of yourself in your own time and in your own way. So I pour a little bit of um, bamboo green tea on there in that little spa of mine. <laughs> I pour a little bit of that, then I add um, some warm water also, I like to use the bath salt, which looks like this. I pour a little bit of that um, bamboo green tea and the bath salt in there. That bath salt is actually formulated for the feet. So I soak my legs and my feet for about 30 minutes or more, depending on what I think my feet needs at that particular point in time. So when I feel like my feet and all the dead cells are ready to be scrubbed off, I grab the stone, it's a local one, but you'll find, it looks like this. This is all the way from Nigeria, by the way. <laughs> Actually, you get the um, alternative um, in the pharmacy or drugstore or supermarket. So I use that stone to scrub off all the dead cells 
on my feet. It feels really smooth. It feels really um, clean. Then I go ahead and use my exfoliating foot scrub. I love to exfoliate. I exfoliate the face, the body, just keep it smooth, silky. <laughs> So I use my exfoliating foot scrub to scrub all the um, residues that might be left from the dead cells. So this does the job for me. This one contains mint and chamomile and also glycerin. Glycerin I, is very good actually for, for um, taking off all the dead cells on your skin. Try it, it's very good if you haven't done so already. So um, then when all that is done, I towel down, dry my feet and I use this foot lotion which contains also mint chamomile and chamomile. This is actually from both and it's, it, it actually does what it says on the, on the pack. It's, um, it's soothing, it's medicated and it's also an antiseptic foot lotion which prevents um, foot odor, antibacteria and medicated um, Content will prevent all those um, foot odor or smelly feet. <laughs> so it moisturizes, it softens, and it conditions my feet. I love it very much. So those are all the things that I use to take care of my mouth, my hands, and my feet. So that brings me to conclusion of the In and Out of Beauty series. Thank you so much. Thumbs up my video if you like it. Share my video with your friends and family and please subscribe to my channel. I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone who has viewed my video and who has subscribed to my channel. I love you very much for watching. All the in information you need I would put in the description box so click to watch. I love you so much and in case you're wondering what I'm wearing I, I had a new hairstyle so let me know if you like it. Leave me a comment. And I'm um, my newfound love. This um little brooch, flower brooch that I picked up, and I have my Chanel J12 watch. So my shirt or my blouse is from Gap. Thank you so much, and I love you for watching. Bye bye, and see you soon.